Hello, anyway, it's Isha Girls of Kai, and I'm back with another video. So, today, guys, you guys have read the title already. Before I continue, don't watch my hair, okay? I'm gonna need you to draw your attention right away, sir. Yes, today I am going to open up my first stool. So, me and my sister, for you guys that don't know, it's predominantly my sister's business, but I am a massive fan and supporter, and I am the brand ambassador of the Louis Noir skincare products. So, we basically sell sheer butter lotion, which is rich in vitamin E oil, which is great for your skin. Not only does it hydrate, it moisturizes, and we are in winter, girl. It's the season where you you put a whole load of grease on your face and you step out and your face still dry well with louis noir you have that problem no more so yeah we'll open up a stool today i am literally about to start getting ready i need to like position this camera somewhere because i'm not about to be holding this all day i thought we were saying though guys i'm feeling real excited because it's like for most of you guys that don't know i work at Foot Locker. So, let me close this window. Yeah, like, as I was saying, for you guys that don't know, I work at Foot Locker, right? So, I feel like I'm so confident in selling, like, clothes and shoes. Like, if we come out with some new shoes or there's some heat in the store, I know how to sell that. Like, you're going to buy that by the end of the day. Period. Period. But when it comes to skincare, I just feel like people are obviously more careful because this is skincare products. Like, they're, they require more knowledge. And I feel like if your product knowledge is not good and you're trying to sell skincare, you're in a bit of a predicament. So I literally did a bit of revision last night, a bit of extra revision. And I feel confident, like, I'm excited to actually go out into the world and sell products that I actually believe in. Because the older I've been getting, the more I've been thinking about, like, yo, when I go to work, I'm spending eight hours a shift here selling products for this man's company and it's like it's not rewarding it's not as rewarding when you're selling it for your your own you know your own business and something that you actually believe in and you feel like it's great so i'm really excited because honestly guys you guys need to check out the louis noir skincare products today like look at my skin i'm literally wearing no makeup apart from the eyebrows you guys just saw me draw on and honestly like it's helped with everything everything is a great product i personally my favorite is the rose garden um sheer butter tub that is oh gosh it's lush absolutely lush i don't know if i should wear lashes today because i feel like yeah they are a little bold they are a little bold i'm gonna wear them though because they are not yeah, I go out of my song, then my creep up. For real, yeah, my ring me, I start from zero. Now my bank account, account zeros. I mean, I tell you, nothing never come free, bro. Guys, you guys need to start listening to Joshi. Oh. <laughs> brown in them oh they're so sexy mm, i love the smell of a d shoe <laughs> i don't know if i should wear these because i feel like the brown would go with the fit or if i should wear converses <sighs> i think i'm gonna wear converses though can't i Guys, I've gone back to leave out. Can you believe it? Like, who would have thought the day would have came? 
honestly leave outs going back to leave outs has been the best decision of my life ever since i started wearing wigs like, as you guys can see i have quite a low hairline and sis ever since i started wearing wigs i've literally been noticing my hairline going further back and back and i'm not feeling it like i had to do something about it real quick so i got this leave out maybe like a week ago now and um it's still holding up well girl the only annoying thing about it is that like you kind of have to straighten it every day your real hair at the top but to be fair like you don't have to straighten it if you like wear um a proper shower cap like one of the really fitted ones in the shower and you just like wrap your hair before you go to bed you could get away with not shaking it the next day like it won't look terrible but when i'm going out like for example today is an occasion i'll straighten the top but like honestly you don't really need to i just choose to because why not guys i really think that i should eat something before i go I think I'm gonna go to like Greg's or something. But the only thing is, I never know what to get from Greg's. Like, everybody always goes, well, everyone I know, they go to Greg's in the morning. And it's like, what do you guys actually get? Because, number one, I don't eat pork. So it's not like I could get a sausage roll. And like, I don't like their chicken bake. Oh, their chicken bake pastries. It just tastes so mushy. I don't like it. What else do they sell? Their croissants are okay, but I feel like it also depends on the Greg's you go to because the Greg's in Central, like when I live where I live in London, um, the Greg's around there, yeah, it slaps. But in Kent, oh, I'm not really feeling it. I'll be so real. No, but I'm telling you, there's something about leap bars. Look at me, sis. Like, I'm telling you, it just looks so natural. Like, I'm in love with this leap out. Oh my gosh. So, this is how, hold on, let me just sort out the side. So, you see what I say, guys? Leave out look so natural. Like, girl, I look good. I look good. I'm literally, this is the new me. Honestly, I don't know why this part is sticking up like that there. Might need some mousse or something. But, yeah, I'm ready to leave. I'm finna pack my bag and then I'm gonna leave out. I'm gonna get back to y'all. So guys, I just made it, like, just about made it. Um, I'm on the train now. I'm gonna go to King's Cross and then change. Our school is actually in Brick Lane, so yeah. I haven't thought about the transportation yet, but we'll get there. Delaying. that's the problem that is the problem but anyway 
I'm feeling real positive. I'm feeling real optimistic. I feel like today's gonna be a good day. You know what I mean? But anyway, check the fit, guys. So I got this little bag. I got this bag from Pretty Little Thing, I think. And I'm wearing it with some jacket. Going with the browns. You know what I mean? Brown and green. But yeah, guys. I will see you when we get there. Look how empty the train is. Like, wait. On a Saturday? Nah. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I get there. right guys i'm gonna close out my vlog today so thanks guys for watching make sure you like comment share and subscribe it has been a success it has and we are done for the day how do you guys feel about the day you know what it was such a success um i think that this is the start of just something so amazing so just inspirational right. and um successful I so, just, you heard it here first. I wasn't done. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Since you decided to interrupt me, it's all right. You go ahead because I know you need to close off your vlogs properly. Yeah. Um, adequately. So, you do that. Thank you guys for watching so much. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Yes. And all of them things. And there. push the bell. Make sure you hit that bell so you know when I post. Um, today. If you don't know, <laughs> then don't say it. It's embarrassing. It is. Anyways, yeah, guys, I'm gonna close out on this vlog. Thank you. A little later. Right now, guys, oh my gosh, my camera looks a mess. So, guys, we've decided to go to a sex shop. There's a lot of sexual things you could get in here. 
<laughs> but look at this penis. Oh my gosh. It feels so real. Not that I know what a real penis feels like, but it feels so real. These are so cute. Yeah. Well, I want to say something because you're blocking. Let me just. <laughs> 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 uh oh. Oh my god, look at this. This is candy string knickers. Wait, what does that mean? Oh, it's actually so they like, sweet. Yeah, so like, and candy nipples, so oh when they do what they need to do. They... <laughs> <laughs> no, stop. But anyway, guys, we're gonna go back to the, we found a gay club, lit. We're gonna go back there, get more lit, and then we'll come back to you. Yeah. You're right. <laughs> Share and hit that subscribe button. I'm coming hard 2022. Bye, guys.